so long since I was last here. How did my brother's turf get so messed up? Is that really you? I can't believe you come back after all this time. Since your older brother Rocco has been assassinated, the balance of the city has been thrown into complete... Jennifer! I've missed you. But I'm furious about Rocco. Justice needs to be served. I came back expecting to see his murderer captured, but instead I see chaos. It's because the other Mafia clans have been at our throats. They're capitalizing on the fact we don't have a boss. That's rough, Jen. However, I'm curious. Why haven't you chosen a new boss yet? You won't believe it. But in his will, Rocco named his younger brother, you, to be our new boss. This whole time, we've been trying to find- What? That's crazy! I can't be your new boss. I don't even know what's going on here. I know it sounds crazy, but trust me, you're our new boss. I'll tell you everything back at the mansion. Let's go quickly. It's not safe to be out in the open. Good call. I feel like I'll get hit by a stray bullet at any time now. Kid, is that really you? I can't believe you actually came back after ten years. It's lucky he did because we certainly couldn't locate him. He thought he came back just to pay his respects. But he will be our new boss. I didn't sign up for this. But if I have to do it, I'll give it my best shot. No! A beautiful Mustang! It must be that blasted Maroni and Erica, his ace assassin, who shot and killed Rocco. He Wait, what? Maroni and my father were business partners? I can't believe he betrayed us. He did. I was the one who found Rocco when he died. Enough chit-chat. We gotta push Maroni back and make- Is that... Hector and Hudson? So, Maroni brought his top soldiers too. Okay, let's go. Someone give me a gun. Boss, calm down. You're our boss now. You can't fight by yourself. That's way- You're right. I'm no use to anyone injured or killed. It's good to know that I can rely on you all. Come quick. I'll show you what to do. Moroni's men are ambushing us thinking we're weak. But they don't know you're here to lead us. Time to shine. I'm not going to let my brother's hard work or his friends get torn down by some relic from the past. Our mobility shall inflict a heavy blow onto our enemy. Oh, you're our new boss? I guess it could be worse. I'm KD, the head biker trainer. My writing will speak for itself. With that said, we specialize in pressuring the enemy's backline with our range and speed. Okay, KD. If your riding speaks for you, then let's see your bikers run Maroni's goons down with a quick counterattack. We'll pave the road with them. The more you fight back, the worse it'll be for all of you. Never back down or surrender! You all will lack a proper boss. I'm giving you all a fantastic offer to work for me. Think about it. I'm the boss now, and we don't need an arrogant sleazebag like you telling us what to do. We heard that. This'll shut you all up. Yeah, we're gonna wipe you out. Come on, everyone! Let's push these goons back!
This was just a warning. Soon, your turf and Get lost, you coward! Yes. Let's go after them. To end it once and for all. No. We shouldn't. Moroni has stronger forces than just this. He is probably falling back on purpose to lure us into a trap. While I want to get to Moroni, Jennifer has a smart point. It's more important that we get stronger, and so we can fight him on equal terms. I guess it's too late to argue about it now. Next time, kid, let's not- You did a fabulous job defending our turf without a single casualty. Later, I will introduce you to some more resources that will help us progress further. That sounds like a plan, Jen. I'll fill Rocco's shoes. Just you wait. Bye.